Legislative IQ. Increase your legislative intelligence with Florida's policy, budget, and campaign monitoring service. Subscribe today at legislativeiq.com. You gotta do something. You have to do something different. Meet Herb Shelton. He's not running for anything, so don't expect to see his name on the ballot. But Shelton has become a big part of one congressional campaign. Shelton's been hand painting signs for Congressional District 2 Democrat Walter Dartland. Shelton recycles old signs used for previous campaigns and paints over them. If somebody wants to discard them, it's not coming out of my pocket, it's not coming out of his pocket. It doesn't cost anything. All right, let's get Mr. Walt Dartland on here then. And he did it without any prompting. He just noticed there were no signs for his candidate around town. He was kind of th thrilled. I mean, he thought it was really something that uh, some people thought that much of him. And how many fans do you ever see out there painting signs for their candidate? Yeah, Especially when he's strapped that he didn't have any. Dartland's raised more than $100,000 for his campaign. His opponent, Neil Dunn, $1.7 million. So he'll gladly take all the help he can get. They took it upon themselves, wasn't my urging, upon themselves to say, well, we don't have the money to buy any, but we will create them. It's just taken off and more volunteers want to do more painting. So it's been a very successful event, thanks to them. Maybe this will help him in his big campaign because he is the underdog right now. All right, let's get her out to dry. Shelton has put up more than 120 hand-painted signs with some help from others around the district. Reporting in Tallahassee, I'm Matt Galka.